Hi, this is Mark Chaxfield. Um, I'm here with a company called Vacancy, and essentially they're going to show me how to hack into an iPhone with a simple bit of dental mold and a bit of Play-Doh. And the reason they're doing this is because at the moment, fingerprint sensors on your iPhone are about 500 ppi. Their new sensor technology uses 2,000 ppi, so it's a lot more detailed. So they're going to show me simply that you can use a bit of Play-Doh, this dental uh, mold, and they're going to hack into this iPhone. Then they're going to show me the new technology and show how much more detailed it is for fingerprint tech. So as you can see right here, this is my, uh, my thumb fingerprint. What they're going to do is put a bit of Play-Doh onto the fingerprint. And then they're going to use that Play-Doh mold on the iPhone. And hopefully, it should show that the iPhone will, uh, will start up thinking that it's actually my fingerprint. So that's just a simple bit of Play-Doh, giving it a few attempts, but it's just opened up that iPhone. It just shows that the tech on fingerprint sensor at the moment is, is not as good as it can be. So essentially, we can see now are going to show me how detailed their fingerprint sensing technology is, uh, being at 2,000 PPI instead of the normal 500 PPI. So at 2000 PPI, you can see that I am a sweaty journalist, NWC. Uh, these white dots here show off sweat pores. And then look at the actual detail of my fingerprint, which looks pretty ugly, to be honest, but we are at 2000 PPI. So um, I'll, I'll let myself off on that one. OK, so that's the fake version. And as you can see, it looks a bit like the craters from Mars. There's no real thumbprint of note. You can see some of the sweat pores but the deep ridges that were uh, on the actual real fingerprint that came up in the 2000 PPI are nowhere to be seen. So this pretty much proves that if you had vacancy tech within your smartphone, you wouldn't be able to hack it, essentially, which is, uh, which is pretty good. So at the moment, uh, water is kryptonite to fingerprint technology in phones. Um, vacancy is saying that you can actually uh, use their technology if, you're, if your hand is wet. So I'm just going to press my thumb on a damp cloth soak all that water up there and just put it back on the fingerprint technology and as you can see the ridges are still there so if you're at the gym and you're hot and sweaty at the moment with your iphone you have to wipe your your hands to uh, use the fingerprint technology uh, this new fingerprint technology actually goes underneath the glass so it means that the uh, sweat doesn't affect it at all Vacancy is hoping that this technology will be in mobile phones. We'll start to see it about early 2017. There's a six to eight month window for getting technology in these, in these phones. So that's why uh, we, ha we haven't seen it yet. But NDAs have been signed and we should see the tech early 2017.